Tachyon. Noun. 1. A hypothetical particle held to travel faster than light. 2. A low latency PCB for arcade sticks by Korean company IST. While checking what's new in the Korean arcade stick market, I saw this PCB. Compared to other boards out there, the Tachyon looked very unassuming, but its draw was what made me interested. I'm the Phantom Knot. I was able to test the Tachyon's lag output. Can it beat the low latency kings at Brook? Let's find out. It's rather fascinating to see IST sell this as they also sell boards from Brook. Being that this board was made to mainly work on PC, it makes sense to have it marketed to Korean players as the platform is dominant. It also works on PlayStation 3 and Switch. Being that IST also sells MakeSick Pro arcades to cases as well, the Tachyon will be more economically efficient for the DIY user in Korea. I used the same Arduino-based lag testing solution by White from the Nakon Digitest. test. Before we go to the results, I do want to mention that the Tachyon natively runs at a pulling rate of 1 millisecond, so it's not needed to be overclocked. Most if not all the Brook fighting boards also run at 1 millisecond, at least when it's on PlayStation 3 or PlayStation 4 modes. Tachyon shows that it runs at an average latency of 1.8 milliseconds with the lowest recorded input at 1.4 milliseconds, and at the highest at 2.2 milliseconds. Based on the 1000 inputs recorded, it's also 90% likely that inputs would trigger within frame. Now let's see how that fares between some of the Brook fighting boards. Despite having the highest input at 3.8 milliseconds, the Universal fighting board has a lower average at 1 millisecond flat. It could also trigger within frame 95% of the time. The original PS3 PS4 fighting board averages at 1.3 milliseconds and inputs can trigger within frame 93% of the time, a slight reduction. When wired, the wireless fighting board basically has the same general results as the Tachyon. Here are some more boards and controllers also placed on the higher end for lower latency from input lag.signs for additional reference. The current Tachyon firmware as of this video has support for the PlayStation 4, but it's still in testing and is prone to 8 minute timeouts. Maybe a future firmware update can solidify PS4 support, as well as make the Tachyon faster? Time will tell. So the Tachyon is not the fastest board on the market. Aside from the slightly higher lag input anomaly, the Brook Universal Fighting Board is still king. That said, the Tachyon is comparable to the other fighting boards as well as being faster than most of the controllers and sticks tested on input lag.science. The problem is that unless you fit the user playing fighting games only on PC and live in Korea, the Tachyon might be the last choice for a low lag board. If you live outside of Korea though, you might as well get a Brook fighting board from your favorite arcade parts store instead of paying import fees for the Tachyon. Until next time, thank you for watching.